I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus. No turning back. No turning back. <laughs> One of the reasons I am a huge proponent on children's ministry, and apart from the fact that God put me in it, and it's been a 20 plus year process of molding my heart and showing me and training me and helping me to finally see the value of it, the surrender, and then having my own children. But my own testimony is that I, my mom was, uh, grew up Catholic in the French part of Canada. And so when we moved to the English part, then an, a Protestant or evangelical church invited her to a Bible study. And she just thought, well, I've always been interested in the Bible. So she went. And for us, that was the beginning of the end. That's where I got saved when I was seven years old at a tiny little church in a tiny little town, asked Jesus uh, to come into my heart and he became real to me. He came into my life in a real way. And that in that little church, at Sunday school every Sunday, and then on Tuesday nights, they had something called Christian Life Club or CLC, and then it was CYC, Christian Youth Club, and we'd go and we'd do little songs and, but, those songs that I learned when I was seven, eight, nine years old, whether in Sunday school at the little club or on a Sunday morning, the old school hymns, the old school choruses, like the one I was just singing, um, I cast all my cares upon you. Oh, I lay all my burdens down at your feet. Those things are still what carry me today, 35 years later. So it's a testimony of how powerful and useful children's ministry is. That's why we do it all the time on the streets. We sing the songs. And I don't despise one the size of a seed. I don't despise the seed the gospel is the power of God and the salvation. When a little kid starts singing, God is a good God. Or like my three-year-old yesterday, I was just on the toilet singing, Victory is mine. Victory is mine. Victory today is mine. I told Satan, get thee behind me. Victory today is mine. Those are songs that are in him at three years old and will be with him the rest of his life. And those are truth and they carry power and they'll carry him through fear, through depression, through obstacles, through challenges, through adventures. And so it's powerful. So I love it. That's why we do it. If you're, Lord have mercy, I'm saying it just to share it as a testimony, but get your kids in Sunday school. Be a part of it. Don't despise it. Get the word in them. Get these songs in them. It makes all the difference. Train up a child in the way they will go. They should go. And when they get old, they will not depart from it. Amen. Love you.